day, it's me Martin and here I have four of the most popular smartphones in the world from the biggest Chinese manufacturers. The Realme 7 Pro, the Huawei Mate 40 Pro, the OnePlus 8T and the Xiaomi Mi 10T Pro and in this video we'll do a speed charging test, so let's get started. The first thing that we have to make sure is of course that all the phones are completely out of juice. It's quite interesting to see that the Huawei and Realme phones are trying to boot, while the Xiaomi Mi 10T Pro and the OnePlus 8T don't boot at all but just show a quick low battery sign. It feels to me that that's much safer than trying to boot the phone. Now let's quickly discuss the chargers. The OnePlus charger is called Warp Charge 65 and is surprisingly charging with 65 watt. The Xiaomi Mi 10T Pro charger is 33 watts, which is the lowest out of all. The Realme 7 Pro has a super dark charger which charges the phone with 64 watt. And last but not least, the Huawei Mate 40 Pro charges with 66 watt. Now let's plug in the cables and turn the electricity on. Please keep in mind that wherever possible the battery optimization is turned off, flight mode is turned on and regarding the capacities of the battery, the OnePlus has a 4500 mAh battery, the Realme has the same capacity, the Mate 40 Pro has a 4400 mAh battery and the Mi 10T Pro has the biggest one out of all, 5000 mAh. After 5 minutes we have the first results in and it's a surprising one. Both the OnePlus and Realme are at 19% while the Mate 40 Pro is at 17% and the Mi 10T Pro is at 14%. Let's check again after 15 minutes. So here we are 15 minutes later and the OnePlus is 56% and the Realme is keeping up at the same pace. Huawei is at 49% and the Mi 10T Pro is at 34%. Let's check again after exactly 30 minutes in. At 30 minutes in the standings are as follows. The OnePlus 8T is at 95%, the Realme 7 Pro is at 94% and the Huawei is at 86%. The Mi 10T Pro remains a bit behind at 64%. And just under 35 minutes both the Realme 7 Pro and the OnePlus 8T are 100% charged. Which is even faster than OnePlus claims themselves with 39 minutes so I am definitely impressed. Are you impressed? Let me know by giving the video a like. The next phone is the Huawei Mate 40 Pro that reaches 100% right before the 15 minute mark and is in line with the company its claim. At the same time the Mi 10T Pro from Xiaomi is catching up rapidly at 96%. It still took quite a while for the Mi 10T Pro to reach 100% and my camera's battery died so I had to quickly switch over to another phone to record the end time, which came in right under a full hour. If we take a look at the charging speed with the battery size in mind, then both the Realme and OnePlus charge on average 2.9% every minute, while the Huawei Mate 40 Pro is stuck at 2%. And last but not least, the Mi 10T Pro is charging with 1.67%. The results are very similar when we take the amount of milliamp hour charged per minute. 
Of course, the results might differ when you have more stuff going on in the background like Wi-Fi, GPS, 4 or 5G and all of the other stuff. But this looked to me the most fair way to compare the charging speeds. The Huawei Mate 40 Pro is underperforming with its 66 watt charger, even when we take the average percentage charge per minute or milliamp hour into consideration. Alright, that's it for this video. Are you surprised about the results? I am for sure, especially with the Realme 7 Pro. How fast it's able to charge considering the price point? That really impressed me. What are your thoughts? Let us know in the comments below. Alright, this video has come to an end, so give it a like if you liked it, subscribe in case you loved it and don't forget to share it with your friends so that we can all hang out in the next video.